Air Actor TB3 Turkey successfully carried out the first high-speed test of the new Bear Actor TB3 unmanned combat aerial vehicle, UCV, medium altitude long endurance, male, class, designed for carrier operations. Turkey's thriving drone industry has witnessed another notable success as the country has successfully conducted the first high-speed roll test of the Bear Actor TB3 drone. Turkish defense company Baykar revealed this development on its official X, formerly known as Twitter, account on October 13th. The company also shared a video with the caption, Bear Actor TB3 successfully completed its first high-speed roll test. The video showcases the drone emerging from the hangar, with engineers diligently preparing it for the subsequent ground test. This milestone comes several months after Selçuk Bear Actor, the chief technology officer of Baykar Technologies, had previously shared images of the carrier-based combat drone, Bear Actor TB3, during its production phase. While the company did not provide a precise schedule for concluding the drone's testing phase, Previous reports have suggested that testing is anticipated to be finalized by the end of 2023. The Bayer Actor TB3 is an armed unmanned aerial vehicle system tailored for carrier operations, distinguished by its foldable wings. It exhibits a slightly larger size compared to its terrestrial counterpart, the Bayer Actor TB2, and offers an upgraded payload capacity of up to 280 kilograms. This unmanned aircraft made its debut in October 2020 and is designed for future deployment on the TCG Anadolu amphibious assault ship. Additionally, the TB3 is anticipated to collaborate with the Bear Actor Kizalelma, a carrier-capable, jet-powered unmanned combat aerial vehicle. The Bear Actor Kizalelma combat drone achieved its maiden flight at the Akinsi Flight Training and Test Center in Korla, northwestern Turkey, on December 14, 2022. This drone has a payload capacity of 1,500 kilograms and is designed to perform air-to-ground and air-to-air -air missions. The Kizalelma, as asserted by the company, exhibits exterior characteristics reminiscent of fifth-generation fighter jets. Baykar additionally asserts that this drone will be proficient in traditional drone missions and conducting air-to-air -air engagements. The Bayer Actor TB3 drone, following in the footsteps of its highly lauded predecessor, the TB2, which gained recognition for its pivotal role in conflicts in Libya, Syria, Nagorno-Karabakh, and Ukraine, introduces a distinctive design. Setting itself apart from its forerunner, the TB-3 is purposefully crafted as a maritime drone tailored for operations on short runways and aircraft carrier decks. The TB-3 UCAV is versatile, capable of conducting intelligence, reconnaissance, and surveillance missions, as well as executing assault operations by deploying smart weapons attached beneath its wings. In terms of size and capabilities, the TB-3 UV outperforms its predecessor, the TB-2. The TB-3 spans 8.3 meters in length, stands at 2.6 meters in height, and boasts a wingspan of 14 meters, while the TB-2 measures 6.5 meters in length, 2.2 meters in height, and features a 12-meter wingspan. Additionally, the TB-3 can accommodate a payload of 280 kilograms, a significant increase compared to the TB-2's 150 kilograms, and it possesses a maximum takeoff weight of 1,450 kilograms, almost double that of the TB-2 at 700 kilograms. This state-of-the-art drone is set to operate from the Turkish Navy's newest flagship, the TCG Anadolu L-400, an amphibious assault ship modeled after Spain's Juan Carlos.
In the beginning, Turkey had contemplated the acquisition of a restricted quantity of fifth-generation F-35B Lightning II short takeoff and vertical landing Stavel fighters for the Anadolu aircraft carrier. However, these intentions were derailed in 2019 when Turkey procured advanced S-400 air defense missile systems from Russia, which led to its expulsion from the F-35 program. As an alternative approach, Turkey adjusted its strategy and repurposed the Anadolu primarily as a specialized drone carrier, capitalizing on its expertise in creating and utilizing armed drones. With its foldable wings, the Anadolu has the potential to accommodate a squadron of 30 to 50 Bear Actor TB3 drones. According to Turkish media reports, the landing helicopter dock, LHD, type ship, TCG Anadolu, is the world's first vessel of its kind designed to accommodate the landing of unmanned combat aerial vehicles, UCAVs, on its deck. Meanwhile, the Turkish defense company hopes this drone will replicate the success of its forerunner, Bear Actor TB2 which is reputed to have been exported to approximately 28 countries. In 2022, Haluk Bayraktar, serving as the CEO of Baykar Defense, made the case that this particular drone model could be exceptionally well-suited for the Japanese military. The upcoming TB3 will be a great fit for Japan's Azumo-class platforms, said Haluk Bayraktar. Nonetheless, the future will reveal whether this drone, primarily tailored for naval operations, can attain a level of success akin to its predecessor.